Rio de Janeiro, city of romance and exotic splendor, whose very name is synonymous with Carnival. And now, one of the backdrops for the newest and hottest James Bond movie, the one that begins where all the other Bonds end, Moonraker. Roger Moore is James Bond, also known as 007. Handsome, cool. James Bond. There's nobody in the world that's like Bond. He's still the super man, super male fantasy thing, and sex fantasy, I guess. Lois Childs has won the role of one of Bond's beautiful women. We've changed, women have changed, and Bond has had to change with it, I guess. <laughs> Long, tiring periods of rehearsal are an important part of filmmaking. Roger Moore isn't the type of actor who complains about this arduous task. Yeah, yeah that's it, and that'll be as far as... Ow! The large part of the tremendous budget has been used for spectacular locations. Director Lewis Gilbert feels these locations are essential to a Bond movie. They want to go and enjoy themselves and it's an escape world. And if they're made well, then I think that you have to do that. As Rio dances, the filmmakers get down to business. Another element of Moonraker, backed by popular demand, is the return of Jaws as Bond's adversary. We've had to bring him back. Partly because there's so many people around the world voting, saying, is he going to come back? 